The running play is a sharp, quick and reliable play which can be guaranteed to gain ground. The key to success in a running play is to have the fastest player or most agile on your team to receive the ball from the quarterback. In the image shown, Mitch Crowden is feeding the ball to George Sand, who will run as fast as he can to the end zone. Once the runner has received the ball, their goal is to try and dodge and weave through the opponent's team by twisting and turning without getting tagged. This is shown when Simon Adkins receives the ball and twists and turns throughout the opponent's team and nearly scores a down. Scoring is how you win matches. It is important to always attack in NFL when you are trying to score. By attacking constantly, you score. An example of attacking play is a running play and a short snap pass turn. These short videos are a quick attacking play that you to score in a real match situation. The passing play. The passing play is the most commonly used play in the NFL alongside the running play. The passing play is commonly used in situations when the team has several downs left and they are close to the end zone. Another time when a passing play has to be used is when a team has scored a down and is in the no run zone. This means the team can only convert a score by throwing the ball into the end zone. The whole idea of a passing play is to gain a quick 15 metres by throwing the ball sharp and fast to the leading player. There is not a great deal of pressure on the quarterback as it only takes 34 seconds for the ball to be released. Learning defense is one of the most important parts of NFL flag football. A lot, of the, a lot of the time, they are great offenders, but when it comes to defending, they are not so good. One of the main ways to tag an opposition is using the technique of channeling. Channeling is where you get the, in the inside or outside line of the player and channel them where to go, this leaving a clear path for you to tag them. Tagging is how you stop an opponent from scoring a down. And as, as soon as the player with possession of the ball is tagged, play stops immediately and where the tag is placed is where the down is. A fantastic defense play is the interception. This is where the opponent play cuts off a throw from the quarterback. The ball, that as soon as run the play to that end zone and score a down. This is why the interception is so good as it catches the off offending team by surprise and 9 times out of 10 the interception leads to a goal. A down is where the offending player has been tagged with the ball in hand. Where the player was tagged, that is where the offending players will have to line up. From where the tag lies, the, the defending team will have, will have to be more than 5 yards away from the offenders. This will give the quarterback and players time to get into the position and the quarterback to deliver it to them. Another way a down can be forced is if the offending team drops the ball. From where the quarterback threw the ball, that is where the down goes.